SMEs are the backbone of the economy, so we need to give them the political support that they need and deserve. In particular, we need to make sure that our work as MEPs makes life easier rather than harder for small businesses. For SMEs to grow and create employment, they need to have their administrative burden kept to a minimum. When we're drafting legislation in the European Parliament, we should always keep that in mind. For example, in the Energy Efficiency Directive I'm working on at the moment, small businesses will be exempted from the energy audits that big businesses will have to carry out. We also need to make it easier for SMEs to access finance such as loan guarantees and venture capital. Most of all, small businesses need banks to be more willing to lend to them, especially in the current economic climate. Because SMEs tend to have a fairly high risk weighting, banks have to hold a relatively high amount of capital against what they lend to them. This is what makes small businesses less attractive to banks in times of stress. One solution would be to ring-fence a certain proportion of the bank's regulatory capital and use that specifically for loans to SMEs. This is a solution that my Lib Dem colleague Sharon Bowles is actively looking into.